Good evening people, welcome to another video, another list video and this time we're going down to 2015, my favourite films of this year I only have 8 that I really enjoyed um, so I'll just jump straight into it with the first one which was this Inside Out Inside Out right there I thought a, a clever film Emotions Inside of a Girl's Head um, everyone has these emotions and how they interact and all that kind of stuff how they charge people and all that stuff um, I thought it was pretty cool it was colourful, it was fun um, don't know if I saw that in a cinema though I can't remember uh, number 7 from this set from this set here it is Ip Man 3 and these are phenomenal martial arts films um Donnie Yen is superb, but what I remember the most from it, Man 3, is it's the one with Mike Tyson. And great fun. Number six is Ant-Man, which and I don't know if I saw this in the cinema, but a fun film. And the first time he shrunk, I think it was in a bathtub. And that effect and him doing that and seeing everything big stuck with me all these years after um, fun film number five a lot of people hate it um, Age of Ultron um, there's a whole scene with is it Savokia, Skavokia and all that business but the opening scene in the snow and I like Ultron um, and it's just I find it to be like most Avengers films, at least back in the day, if you're calling 2015 back in the day, they were fun, they were a spectacle, they looked cool. So that's that one. Number four, I did see this in the cinema, and it was The Martian. Mark Watney gets stuck on Mars, he's got to survive, they find out he's alive, so they go and get him. It's not that easy. Based off a book, which I've also read. Number three is Spectre. I saw this in the cinema and cheered when I saw that um, Christoph Waltz was, was Blofeld and the cat. I went like that in the cinema. But it's fun film. I've seen it many times since. Number two is The Witch, Witch, the Witch, Witch or The Vivitch which I heard people call boring and dull and I can see that, I completely can see that but from the moment they leave or they get kicked out of their little, their, little, their home in that, was it a plantation or, or a Puritan village? Something like that. They get kicked out of it and then they take up residence on the edge of a forest. It just hits every note for me and I love it. But number one is a film I've just recently rewatched again and it's fantastic, one of the best action films of the last 20 years. It is, of course, Mission Impossible Rogue Nation. Um, great scene in the, the theatre with her, everything that's going on there. Um, climbing on that big... No, he doesn't climb on the big one. That's the, that's the one before that. Ignore that. Strike that. Reverse it. Um, just I was thinking of Ghost Protocol when he runs, runs along and up that tower. Yeah, I've just watched them one to six again. Um, but yeah, that's that's great stuff. Rogue Nation. Love the Mission Impossible films. He hangs off an aeroplane. Of course he does. And goes into that big pool of water. Of course he does. That's the one. Rogue Nation is my favourite film of 2015. And that is it. 